If you decide to use a PowerPoint for your presentation, you do not want it to be filled with full paragraphs of text, but instead with short bits of information. A great way to add interest to your PowerPoint is through the use of photos. These could include images of the composer, performance venues, or artworks representative of the time. For example, if you are playing a piece from the Impressionist movement, you might want to feature Claude Monet's Impression Sunrise. A good place to start searching is on the Art Research Guide. Once there, you will see an Images tab. On this tab, you can see many resources for finding the photos that you want. Notice that Google Images is a perfectly valid way to begin searching as you can quickly search a variety of terms. However, Art Store is a really great place to find famous artwork. A quick search of Monet's painting will bring it right up. Once you have chosen some images that will enhance your presentation, you must remember to cite them. To cite an image in Chicago style, you will need to know the artist or photographer's name, the title of the photo or artwork, an indication of the medium, so whether it is photography, painting, a sculpture, and the publication date and URL. This is all of the information for the Monet painting, and this is what a citation would look like in Chicago style. The best way to incorporate this citation would be to put it directly below the photo on the slide of the PowerPoint. This process can be used in other citation styles as well. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask.